within four years, it will land in South America, more precisely in one of the most receptive cities of Brazil, Fortaleza, the state capital of Ceará, with almost three million people, enchanting sand beaches, average temperatures of 27 degrees Celsius all year round, and the shortest entrance door from Europe. That is the landscape of our next meeting. As a tropical country, Brazil is an ideal and exciting place, able to provoke evocative sights, smells and sounds never actually experienced in person, but as potent in our imagination as to have become emblematic of the country. Amazonia, the most fascinating rainforests of the world, are in the northern of Brazil, presenting the highest concentration of biodiversity on the globe. This is the part of our country of continental dimensions which houses the largest reserves of oxygen on Earth. With approximately 8.5 million of square kilometers, Brazil presents a large variety of biomes, characterized according to the predominant vegetation. IBIS World estimates that global biotechnology industry revenue should reach $228.6 billion in 2012, having increased at an average rate of 10.4% annually over the past five years. Global biotechnology market should surpass $320 billion by 2015, according to the new report by the Global Industry Analysts Incorporation. Brazil has the largest fresh water resources in the world, rivers and amazing waterfalls with huge potential to generate hydroelectricity. Besides intensive solar radiation, there are constant winds with sufficient speed to blow windmills along the thousand kilometers of coastal areas and semi-arid lands ideal to grow different species like microalgae. The country has the cleanest energy matrix in the world, with 46% of it coming from renewable resources. Brazil has a vast extension of arable land to supply food for domestic and export demands with a diversified production of commodities like sugar, fruit, flowers, vegetable oils, fish, and meat. Brazil is also able to provide biofuels, such as ethanol and biodiesel, sufficient to supply national and international markets through Petrobras Biocombustíveis, its new green company. These are just a few of the natural resources of this country's wealth. Brazilian agribusiness is the most important economic sector, responsible for about 10% of its GNP. Brazilian efforts are now directed to the production of added value products, one of the main goals of the green economy. The 16th IBS 2014 should contribute to achieve sooner green technologies to safely accomplish the high biological species productivity while reducing ecological damages. There is a high level of awareness in Brazil and worldwide of the strategic benefits that the green economy will bring to developing countries in favor of rural development with social equity. The Ministry of Science and Technology and its associated agencies is providing universities and research centers with a solid infrastructure to support and introduce the country's productivity and the most qualified index to place the country inside a new era of knowledge. The promotion of scientific development in the field of public and social health are the main objectives of prominent institutions like Instituto Oswaldo Cruz and Fiocruz, as well as Butantan Institute, which is one of the main biomedical research centers in the world in the areas of biology and biomedicine, concerning vaccines and serums for the prevention and treatment of several diseases. Another good example of this effort is represented by Embrapa, comprising over 40 research centers, working on a multi-research program of education, training, and innovation related to animal, plant physiology, 
genetics, and transgenic species. These are essential tools for the improvement of the agricultural and husbandry productivity, which is the core of the agribusiness. Henoch Bio is a doctorate program of biotechnology supported by CAPIS, involving more than 50 academic and research institutions in the Brazilian Northeast. Henoch Bio is honored to support and to welcome the 16th IBS 2014 under the auspices of IUPAC. The Brazilian Association of the Chemical Industry is investing about $20 billion in renewable chemistry in 2000-2020. To achieve this goal, the chemical industry counts on the accomplishments of the Brazilian Network of Green Chemistry to promote innovative processes towards a sustainable economy. Regulatory policies, bio-law, entrepreneurship, and international cooperation are essential issues to be discussed during the 16th IBS. Brazil is now a world of business opportunities. It is a country that took the advantage of its natural and human resources to embrace worldwide markets respecting intellectual properties and international established rules. Brazil is one of the most prosperous growing economies in the world, on the track to be wealthier than most of today's economic powers by 2050. Besides that, Brazilian culture is a friendly and receptive one, accepting and accommodating people from different countries and cultures. Enchanting Rio de Janeiro, a world heritage city, Sao Paulo, the industrial and financial center with diversified cultures in southern Brazil, the colorful and typical cultures, music, and gastronomy of the northeastern region are like other worlds inside the country. Come and discover the country that is the nation of natural resources, the land of fantastic handcrafts and ancient magic sustained by a naturally creative people. The sunny city of Fortaleza waits for you with its natural and beautiful beaches, handcrafts, sea gastronomy, a prosperous economy in which its wealth is equally divided between agriculture and industry. The state government of Ceará is working hard to create infrastructure to support a large industrial complex in the Borden port in Pesain. This complex comprises a refinery, a steel company, thermoelectric power plants, and the export processing zone. The EPZ aims to strengthen strategic sectors like renewable energy, added value products from agribusiness, and a poll on health biotechnology, among others. To achieve these goals, the Ceará State Government is establishing national and international partnerships, and whenever necessary, making massive investments. Fortaleza is honored and proud to host the 16th IBS 2014 Participants and Leaders in Business. See you in Fortaleza.